In this video help file, we're going to look at the free program called The Hat. In school, to load up The Hat, if you go to the Programs file on your desktop, you'll find there's a little hat icon. In here, this program will randomly select names from a list. Now, you can pick in individual names or you can pick pairs. To use uh, the hat, okay, you have a list of names and you have the little hat symbol. Now, for example, this isn't the class that I would like, so I'm going to find the new class. I'm going to go up to File. I'm going to go to Import Names from a File. And I'm going to find my names. Now, in school, in the DFS drive, so I'm going to go to DFS, Teachers Pool. There's a folder in here called The Hat Names. Here it is. I'm just going to double click on there. And we have a list of all the names in the children in the classes. You'll notice that we also have the class names and also the English sets and the math sets. I would like to load up the demo class. So I'm going to just double click on the demo class. It's going to ask me if I would like to overwrite the current list. So this is the old list. I'm just going to overwrite it. This does not delete the list of names. It just removes them from the HAP program. And here we go. The list of children and people in the new list. So I'm going to shuffle these names up so nobody's got any idea which name is going to come out first. And I can now go up to the little hat symbol and I can click on it. And here we have it. We can just click on the pick button and it will randomly select any name from any order out of that list. Here we go. And another one. This is really useful when you're using it in a class situation. Children don't know which names are going to come out, so they tend to listen more carefully and see if their name is going to come out. You can save the results to a Windows file, and you can also print them out in case you need to keep them for groups. It's also very useful. What we can do is, back in the little hat program, we can pick pairs of names. So this time, two names will come out. There we go. And this is great if you want to pick groups of children to work together. For your copy of the HAT program, you can visit the harmonyhollow.net website, where you'll find not only the HAT program, but lots of other useful programs for free.